Last time on Game Grumps. What do you think it could be? <laughs> what is this, Dora the Explorer? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it, do you see Swiper? <laughs> However, if you just erase letters, you won't be able to clear the game. That sentence was called Franklin. Mm -hmm. Ultimately, the main goal <laughs> of improved Hangman's Gambit is completing the keyword. Display the quote. Oh my God! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Stop! Stop it! <laughs> Stop! Please, no! I feel like I'm being beaten to death with words. Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the game Grumps. Hello, and welcome to Dan Gone Ron Put 2, the never ending first trial. <laughs> Dan Gone Ron. Pa. Maybe. Maybe this game is only one trial. Maybe this is the whole murder mystery. Nope. It's just to find out who killed Byakya. Nope. It says case one. <laughs> okay, perfect. And there are two digits. Uh, well, uh, it's, yeah, it's, it Regardless, doesn't, the voice acted. Since we can't go under the floorboards from outside, Chiaki and I already confirmed that. I love the way he talks. It's so, like, I mean, just the more mundane, the funnier. Like, tomorrow is Thursday because today was Wednesday. <laughs> Yo, what the hell is up with, what's her face's face? Akani? Yeah. Yeah, she's... She's pretty mad about something. Well, she's like, but what? Like, she's kind of, kind of like, a cut. Anyway. Someone definitely <laughs> went under the floorboards through the storage room during the party. During the party? It was probably during the blackout. How long was that blackout? It wasn't very fast. Bye, Allie. Bye, Al. Well, if someone disappeared during the blackout, no one would have noticed. But walking down that dark hallway to the storage room is like trying to make eggs benedict without any eggs. Then there's only one way I like my eggs. Fertilized. <laughs> I couldn't even see the office in that darkness. And that room was much closer. But is it really impossible? Nothing's impossible, Mario. Only improbable. Wow, nice. Better if we examine that possibility a little bit more. <laughs> There's no way you'd be able to find your way to the storage room. But I can't stop thinking about her. It's so hot. Those locks. That storage room. All the st storage. I can put my dick in it. <laughs> <laughs> like if I'm making my hand like this, I can put my dick in between the fingers. And it'd be like a... I feel like there's something I overlooked. For clarity's sake, once again. Yes, we're getting close to the final stage. No, we're not. We're not. <laughs> I can tell you for a hundred percent. The blackened or the spotless? Which is superior? I think it's time to settle this. Or maybe fifty-five minutes from now. <laughs> I feel like blackened chicken is better than spotless chicken. Mm, well. Oh, what is this? Agree what? to disagree. Oh man, what are these? I actually am jealous of Biakia that he's dead and didn't have to deal with this. <laughs> It's framed as him being a victim, but he's actually the one who gets off easy. It's like making a seafood bowl without fish. Why can't I block the words? The silencer. Oh, that one worked. There you go. What a pain. I'm gonna go with my gut. What if they used a lock? Oh god, the fuck the buttons. No, you're wrong. I agree with that. <laughs> oh no, I agree with it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I agree. <laughs> what if they use the light? Yes! <laughs> Sorry. Oh, I was right? But well done. they have found a light? Man, fucking the kitchen. One nearby for sure. See? It's written on the kitchen's equipment list. Jesus Christ. All this deduction could have happened in three minutes. Three forks. I'm just gonna move on. Okay. <laughs> there are also iron plates for barbecue and even a portable stove for cooking hot pots. Iron plates and a portable stove. I do recall seeing them on the shelf over there. And Mrs. Barfy Mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. I vastly prefer this Biakia. Uh, oh yeah, he's way cooler. Yeah. 
This kitchen seems to be well kept. There should be no problems using it. It's the portable stove. <laughs> uh huh. It's affordable and useful. The, the camera just keeps panning away from him. It's like, hey, over here. <laughs> the portable stove isn't powered by electricity, and it's also small enough to carry around. There's something in my eye. There's something. Mm -hmm. I just didn't get it. <laughs> so, the killer used the portable stove to move from the hallway to the storage room during the blackout. Okay. I see. I never considered the portable stove. But there's a hole in your argument. What's the <laughs> hole? <laughs> oh! the hole? See? What kind of hole? Oh God! It would be great if you could explain Jesus. it to me in much more detail. Put those fingers away, please. You're so funny, Terry. Terry. Oh, making a perverted joke or anything? It's really not a perverted joke. I'm, I'm serious. Okay. Repeating yourself but, just makes it even more suspicious. I mean, he could be the killer, right? Oh yeah. What the heck is this saying over there? <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting a little tired, I'm sorry. <laughs> Will you battle again? What is this, Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah. No, that's wrong. What the- what? Now we rap battle! Oh, it's the sword Will thing. Will you be able to break through my argument? <laughs> yeah, sure. Cut through it with your swords. What does he mean, battle? It sounds like he's enjoying a game or something. Damn it, there's no way I'm gonna lose against someone like him. My friend. Who I guess isn't my friend anymore. Right. Rebuttal showdown. Oh, for fuck's sake. I... Did you forget what Kazuichi said earlier? He said the hall was too dark to see the office. The light from the stove that you mentioned. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm trying to say things. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm, this is extremely rude. I, 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 please. <laughs> I don't doubt what Kazuichi said. What are you trying to say? Um. Words? The reason Kazuichi couldn't is because the hallway was dark, right? So if a light was shining in such a dark hallway, um, shit. wouldn't Kazuichi have seen it? Uh. After all, he was walking near the hallway, right? Who's Kazuichi? Kazuichi's the the Yakuza guy. No, that's. Is it? No, that's Fuyi. Fuyi Hold on. Kiko. Hold on. Kazuichi's Kazuichi is soda. Oh. So Wait, why is why are they talking about him? I don't know. Wouldn't Kazuichi have seen it? After all, he was walking near the hallway, right? Wait, what? It's true that any light source in the dark hallway would have stood out. So if the killer did have a light, the reason Kazuichi wasn't able to see it was the reason Kazuichi couldn't see it because I, the hallway was I don't know. Dark. I'm not so even gonna pretend like I'm I know. I'm hallway. just I'm looking it up. Wouldn't Kazuichi okay. have seen it? Uh fuck. God damn this shit. After all, he was walking Wait. near the hallway, right? What? Why didn't that work? Oh my god! Slashy, 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 slashy! was shining in such a dark hallway. Keep going. Kazuichi have seen it? Allow me to cut through those words. Oh my god. I always forget that's what he said. It's so absurd. Nagito, did you forget? Or are you just pretending you forgot? Or did you forget to remember that you forgot? Huh? What are you talking about? There should have been a wall that blocked light. What do they call those again? Talking about the oh yeah, walls. If you close it, it would form a perfect wall in the hallway. Plus, yeah, the hallway that's rounds what a door does. just beyond the fire door. So even if there was a small gap in the door, as long as they passed the corner, oh my the god, like. Wouldn't peek out. So the thing is, when a door is closed, <laughs> it almost becomes part of the wall. Uh, to actually notice the fire door, just as expected of the ultimate. Oh, you still don't remember your talent, do you? I know it. You're douchebag, bullshitter. <laughs> Who cares about that right now? Nagito, what are you plotting? You're the ultimate antenna. For someone who insists he's not the killer, you are quite nosy. You sound so scary. If you're that angry. Why don't you take a deep breath of this poison gas? Would you sure like to piss us off? How about I shut your fucking mouth for you? Hey! Fuck him, fuck him. You <laughs> don't <laughs> <laughs> I won't allow a burly bro that might have Shut the fucking mouth! Shut up, fuck you! <laughs> More importantly, can you hurry up and decide who's the blackened already? Yeah, who the fuck is the blackened? When I get bored. <laughs> Fine, I get it. 
You're telling me to pass the torch, right? Pass the torch? What? Nah, I'm going excuse to me. ask the real killer, not an imposter like me, to show themselves. What? Um. Is happening. <laughs> <laughs> You're obviously the killer, right? Sorry, I've got something in my ear. I've, I it can't wait. I've got to get it. <laughs> I can't hear. <laughs> and she's like, ah! Okay. <laughs> I really don't mind. Whatever conclusion you ultimates arrive at, I will accept it, no matter what it is. I don't care. <laughs> so you're telling me to call out the real killer, even though I really don't want to condemn that person. But there's no other way, right? We've all figured it out, right? The person who used the hallway's fire door as cover and used the portable stove to move in the dark and snuck under the floorboards to stab Yaki to death using the glowing paint as a mark and they ran away and got away with it. So the only killer I can think of is... It's fucking Teru Teru. You and only you? Oh. The only killer I can think of is... It's Teru Teru. Yeah, right? I think so too. He's gotta be Kitchen, oh. kitchen Man. God. You're the only one! Get rid of him. Terror, terror. Could it be you? Hmm. Oh, what? Oh, what oh. are you talking about? Terror, terror is the killer? Is that true? I thought he was just gross. What are you talking about? There's no way. Of course, that's simply my assumption. So if you have an objection, please speak free. Objection I want to fuck everybody. <laughs> like the My hair looks like shrimp. <laughs> I have a tidy hat and other things. <laughs> That's it. That's the only reason you're treating me like a killer. Isn't that a little drastic? I like how he's like smiling in his profile. Picture. Yeah, yeah. He's like, ha! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Don't be cruel. Cause I would never be that cruel to you! Uh, Teru Teru. That attitude is so not like you. So unhorny. <laughs> so upset. Call me chef. If you fall to aspersions like this, call me murder. I mean chef. The future of the culinary arts. I don't know what aspersions the means. Of the culinary arts. That's right. For the future of the culinary arts, you must face this and fight it fair and square. You're right. Yeah, that's totally right. It'd be nice if these people talked like people. <laughs> so what's You've come to the wrong place. Anyway? Is it yummy? Ah, yes. An aspersion in a white rind reduction. <laughs> Did you know asbestos is yummy too? You should try some later. <laughs> oh, Yoko. Always there with some delightful quip. Those cure those curly cues on your head are getting me so damn hot. <laughs> I can't think straight. Nagito, why are you interfering? Let's assume that the killer used a light. And that they used the fire door to mask that light. And that they moved to the storage room and snuck under the floorboards. Then what? Then they murdered Byakuya. It's dark under the floorboards too. So how would they be able to stab Byakuya? You're not gonna say they shined the light on Byakuya, right? The plan would have been ruined if he noticed. Maybe they stole the, the goggles. That's right. What do you think about that? <laughs> yeah. That's... There's no, no way good. you can answer, right? You personally haven't investigated what's beneath the floorboard. Or have you, murderer? <laughs> Then Gundam should know. He actually went under the floorboards. It was dope. <laughs> no. Unfortunately, there was nothing related to the incident under the floorboards. Just a flashlight and a couple knives. Mm. And a bunch of hot hamsters ready for sex. I mean... <laughs> I know the stereotype is gerbil, but... Nah. What? A shining liquid in the I'm dark. working my way up to the chonker. <laughs> that sounds super important. If there was a shining mark like that, they would have been able to move to it in the dark, right? And in doing so, it might have been possible for them to use that mark to target the victim. Okay. The victim was targeted by a mark. I don't know anyone named Mark. <laughs> uh... What? 
bloodstained knife found under the table where the body was discovered. Gaps in floorboard? But, what, oh, were you talking about a mark? Wait, what's the problem? I don't. The victim was targeted by uh. a mark. What was the mark? Uh... I guess it was the knife, because it glows. Targeted by a mark. Oh, I see what you're saying. So we're looking under the floorboard for something that glows. Oh, I see. Yes. I mean, that's stupid, but... I can prove it with this! <laughs> this stupid! The mark you're talking about is the glowing paint that was applied to the knife, right? Ah, by using the glowing paint as a target, they were able to judge where to stab, even in the dark! But why would... <sighs> Duh! I see. The killer didn't target an actual person, they just struck the moment the glowing paint moved. Sure. All according to plan. That sure. would be the moment someone grabbed a hold of the knife. So, the killer used the mark that I prepared for finding the knife as a mark for stabbing. Then why would you... I see. Ugh. That's why Byakuya got killed when he took the knife. They were trying to kill me! I think so. But if they were able to do that, wouldn't that mean the killer knew about Nagito's plan all along? Well, Teru Teru! Did you know about his plan all along? No. Okay then! <laughs> I am sorry. Honestly, I don't know anything. Really, I don't know anything at all. A lot of sweat. Y yes. Ignore the fact that I'm melting like a snowman. Then can I ask everyone a question instead? You again? Just stop already! <laughs> Just imagine her saying that at the drive-thru. <laughs> That's three burgers! <laughs> Just stop already! Now, now. We should give everyone a fair opportunity to speak. If Teru Teru is the killer, that would mean he went to the storage room during the blackout. And just what did Ibuki hear during the blackout? Sounds! <laughs> <laughs> exactly! What the hell? What's going on here? This, this is... Ow! Turn the damn lights on! I can't eat like this, you know! You guys? Where are you? Wasn't the blackout just in the kitchen? She heard Teru Teru's voice in the dining hall. Ah, shit. Does it sound kind of underneath the floor? Yeah, coming, yeah. Doesn't that prove Teru Teru was in the dining hall during the blackout? That's right. That's exactly it. But Teru Teru was in the kitchen the moment the blackout occurred, right? So, why was he in the dining hall? I... I thought the blackout was only in the kitchen, so I panicked and ran out of there. Of course, the hallway was dark too, but somehow I managed to move along the wall toward everyone's voices. He did say that way before the trial. Yeah. Well, it's not that far to move along the wall from the kitchen to the dining hall. That sounds fishy. If I remember correctly, you can tell when a person is lying by licking their sweat. That's not true. I never heard that in my life. You, want, you should try licking me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Pounces on you. Yeah. <laughs> no way. You look greasy. But I heard Taro Taro's voice in the dining hall. Ibuki swears on her honor. That's right. Teru Teru was in the dining hall, not the storage room. Guys, Which means you know sound can carry through holes in the floor, right? Like... No, that's not it. Why? Why do you want to keep falsely accusing me? It's not like I want to blame you. I mean, calm I the just... fuck down. Uh, yeah, I just know you're a killer. <laughs> you should be so proud of yourself, Hajime. You just progress. Oh, it's pronounced hajime. <laughs> Sorry, I should have said earlier. Now, Hajime, show me more of your hope. Will that be enough to crush Teru Teru's hope? Is Nagito like a <laughs> Monsters Inc. style absorber of hope and despair? Or I have something? no idea. He's got something going on like that. I think he's an agent of Monokuma. And I think he is the original guy. Mmm. Naegi? Yeah. I wonder. Let me ask you again. 
Did you go to the storage room during the blackout? Yes. There's no way I went to the storage room. I was somewhere totally different. Sounds pretty fishy. I definitely heard Teru Teru's voice. Yeah. It's handsome, unlike his face. Okay. Maybe it was recording or something? Nope, definitely a live voice. Okay. If a book is right, right. As long as I have her testimony. The fact that I was in the dining hall. There it is, there it is. Yes. Through that contradiction. Um, but we can hear it through the slippers. This is Chan that can travel through the slippers. In the dining hall doesn't mean he was literally in the dining hall. Huh? He could have been Why? figuratively in the dining hall. <laughs> Emotionally. In the dining hall, full of gas, right? So even if you shouted from under the floor, it should have sounded just like the voices in the dining hall. Yes, that's true. Voices do travel through air. <laughs> oh my God. It would have sounded like it was under the floor. <coughs> but, floor but, 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 but. They only draw those pictures when you're guilty. Yeah. I see. So he brazenly shouted from under the floor to make us think he was in the dining hall. Is that true, Teru Teru? We have no evidence of that, but that's just what we're saying. Hold on a second. Can you explain this, Teru Teru? I told you to wait a sec, ain't I? <laughs> what? Do you, what, you got a, like a southern accent? I don't know. What are y'all even saying anymore? I'm telling you I was in that there dining hall door. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he's Cajun. What the fuck? Where are you from again? Ooh, I was born in West Asafu and raised in South Ayuyama. Oh, he's, that's, he's like a southern, he's a Japanese southerner. Oh, I see. He's like the equivalent of... It's called Osaka Ben. He sounds like Foghorn Leghorn. <laughs> hey, you guys! This guy's a major liar! If Teru Teru was in the dining hall during the blackout, he should have been there after the power returned, right? Well, I believe so. There's no way he could have gone back and forth in that dark hallway. Huh? Was a Teru big Teru dark hallway. I, I sure was. I was there the whole damn time. <laughs> Something like this what, should be what is that accent? I don't know. He'll be dead soon. There's no way they would make this voice actor do this for the rest of the game. <laughs> Damn right! You guys should have been deciding this on the spot with your hazy memories. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> Trying to place this. Definitely lying. However, I am not sure. I believe that he was there, and I believe that he was not there. Thank you, Sonia. Yeah, you really. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> no. Is there any way we can decide? Why don't we consult his memories? Oh, sure. Oh, yes, of course. Let me just plug him in. Let's just make a withdrawal at the memory bank. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> his memories. Shout out to yeah, MST3K fans. Yeah. That guy don't make no sense. Can you even prove I wasn't in the data hall? Well, ring a ding dang do, Teru Teru. I yes. <laughs> Probably can. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, you again. Whether or not Teru Teru was in the dining hall during the blackout, in order to know for sure, I just need to throw that question at him. Well, it's so weird hearing that voice come out of him. It just reminds me of fishing with cra f f crawdads in Osaka. <laughs> fishing for crawdads. There, there is a there is a Japanese southern accent. I'm sure there is. I mean. My uh, first Japanese tutor, I actually think it's embarrassing clothes. Because that's the one thing he would remember. Oh, it could be. I forgot all about that. I can prove it with this. <laughs> if you're claiming that you were in the <laughs> It's all stuck together. <laughs> uh hold on just a sec. You should know how Nikon was positioned at the time. Right. Well what? Give him hints, shut up! No, this is a very important question. Well, Teru Teru, if you were really in the dark. Remember when you fell time, puss out you while the other girl was that. shitting? <laughs> what kind of game is this? <laughs> and possibly farting! <laughs> huh? Um. It was a pretty clever way of tripping. There's no way you'd forget about tripping. it so easily. <laughs> 
I like how they wrote out spread eagle. It's like, oh, oh, is that? Oh, okay. uh, I get it, yeah. Sometimes uh, when I hit A, it just doesn't go. Hmm. Really lets you want to think about it. Uh, huh? That's weird. Just slipped from my mind. There's no way it would slip from your um, mind. No Especially way. not a pervert like you. What the heck are you saying? Of course, perverts do get 20% off of all <laughs> curly fries. <laughs> Wendy doesn't serve curly fries. I don't know. It was all I could think of. <laughs> Nagito, say something. Hmm. I guess you might have to give up now. Oh, thank God. Give up? What do you mean, give up? Fucking Here. die. I'm disappointed too, you know. I loved you. It's lonely watching someone I admire reach the limits of their hope. It kind of feels like a broken dream. Okay. Nagito, what are you doing? Why are you messing with the killer like that? Well, hold, hold on a sec. Don't go moving this along on your own like I really am the killer. <laughs> okay. <Huh? laughs> but it's already decided, All right. Is he like trying to do like a share has nothing to do with this? <laughs> like, it's like, um, obviously, we believe in life after love. It's like an old, uh, you know, like a dare say, mercy me. Is that what yeah, you're yeah, yeah. Do? It's like in Futurama, the, the chicken lawyer who's like, I'm sorry, I thought you was corn. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wasn't when they took the uh, inventory in the kitchen? Wasn't something missing? There was a knife missing. Yeah. Also, if they stab from under the floorboards, the weapon would need to be at least fifty centimeters in length. After all this, oh no, it was a skewer. Yes, skewers was missing. Which makes sense because it was the millimeter thing. It was too small to be a knife. He said, "Not good enough." Not good enough at all! Thank you, Manami. Alright, dude, we can all understand. Fine, I got it. Let's try thinking about what the weapon was. What a door, what a door! Okay. <laughs> um, he said, try to do it. What a confusing accent! Anyway, <laughs> we need to focus and think about this. Um, a thin edge tool with a diameter about 50 millimeters, at least 50 centimeters in length, 50 actual meters. The weapon that meets those requirements might have been used at the crime scene. Huh, what's that? <laughs> the skewer. I gotta spell it now. Oh, no, my god. Iron. Uh, oh, yeah. Iron skewer. You so smart, Aaron. You so smart. Fuck! Ooh. <laughs> Oops. There's so many. Oh, stop at the ends. Stop at the ends. She's. It's like your dream wheel of fortune scenario. Oh my god, the K's? Why do I? Why am I keeping the? Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna leave this here. Get rid of this. This. W. Mm hmm. I wrote. Oh my lord. It's like, screw the fucking letters I need. Oops. N is what you need. <laughs> Save that. Oh. Okay. K. Uh oh. Fuck. Uh oh. Oh no! Fuck! This fucking shit sucks. Oh, I can just like move them. Oh, neat. 
Do the E's. Yes. They're the W's. Oh, I can make it bigger. Whoa! Oh my god. Oh, I can actually use it. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops! Fuck this shit. I'm out of here. Oh, god damn. oh my lord. Fuck up. There it is. Uh, yeah. Yes! <laughs> well done. I've got it! <laughs> I just thought of it! I R O N! Uh, hold on, I'm thinking of all the letters. Must be the iron skewer. Huh? The iron skewer? Yes, iron skewer. I R O N S K E W E R. Iron skewer. Can you use it in a sentence, please? Terror, terror, stab Bianca with the iron skewer. Place of origin, please? The kitchen. <laughs> um. It's like another 10 minutes, so. Oh my I'm god! I want to next time on Game Grumps, or. Because I gotta pee. All right, go pee, you sexy man. Thank you. Next time on Game Grumps, at least we know who the killer is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My goodness gracious. So let's see how he dies on the next episode. I'm excited. Goodbye. Iron Skewer. Yeah.